Good morning. Right, done live stream super early this morning. And while we were doing that live stream, going through a bit of retro foodie, we noticed that she'd popped up um, and she was doing a live. So we decided halfway through, let's go and see what she's got to say. Well, she's raging. She's raging at her viewers again, the very people that pay her wages, the very people that have paid for this trip for her to have an absolutely miserable time couldn't have happened to a nicer person a more worthy person, this devout Muslim, I've changed, I'm this, I'm that, how many times have we heard it? Well, she hasn't changed at all, not that any of us were dumb enough to think that she had, but here we have a beautiful display of just our bitter, twisted and nasty, food it really is, deep down. I um, guess she was I don't know, was she a little bit hungry, needed a snack? I mean, she wasn't stuffing her face. It seems to be the only thing that brings her any joy whatsoever, um, which is a sad old life. But just listen to this. I've sped it up 1.3 because she's slow as. So, um, yeah, here we go. That's not true, Mandy. He can't. How did he come here to? How did he come here before? He came here before. <laughs> like. He's not a refugee. Like, this is what pisses me off. You people are retarded. You don't know the first thing about anything about his status. You don't know, like, you're just making shit up. He's a refugee. Where? See, she, she's been told in her chat, I've, I've got I've got a child who's got disabilities. I've got I've got son, a daughter, or I myself have got disabilities. I find that really offensive when you use that word. So she doesn't just use it once, I'll know. How is he a refugee? What are you talking about? <clears throat> Idiots. Such a high intellect. Sorry, he's... Yeah, goodbye, Mandy. You don't know shit. Block, block, Stop block, coming block. here spreading your lies. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Anyways. It's a bit rich coming from the biggest so liar. Stupid. Yes, I say retarded. I don't care. Like, what? Like whatever. Too bad. And there we have, this is the real Chantal, folks. Yeah, isn't she nice? Isn't she nice? She doesn't care if you're offended by that, if you're hurt by that. No, because you know what? There's only one person in Foodie's life that actually matters to her, and that's her. I've never known such a self-absorbed horror. Because it is. It's stupid. Like, it's just ridiculous. <clears throat> so that's twice she said it. Doesn't care. Yeah, and I'm sure you're um, you're very happy about that swag, Daddy. Goodbye. She's having like, such a nice. There's holiday. no reason for you to come in here and make BS up, drama out of nothing. Where's your husband? <laughs> stupid. He's not a refugee. He doesn't like. He came here before. Salah can't come to Thailand. That has nothing, nothing, nothing to do with why he's not here. That's what I'm saying. Nobody knows anything. Like, you're left up to speculation. Yeah, and this is whose fault is this? You're the one that keeps lying. You're the one that keeps lying. He was never going. You may as well just say, I'm on a visa run uh, and I'm taking a month out. There you go. We'll back ourselves into a corner then, would we? Oh no, but you, you, yeah, that would put the whole fake marriage into question, wouldn't it? Wherever the hell your arrangement is, it's warped. You're warped. And, and I don't really care. I don't really care. But people will care from what's spilled out your mouth. She doesn't stop. Well, you're making up the dumbest, dumbest, most retarded theories. Number three. She's doing this on purpose. That she's so she's doing this on purpose because she's a spiteful person all the way through. Okay, like no, it's not okay, foodie. You know damn well what you're doing. I don't it. know. Just every every possible stupid negative thing you can think of is not. It's like not none of it's true. <clears throat> and this is one known for telling the truth, right? I know, they're always rude. That's why they're blocked, and that's why they had to come back on another account. Like, I don't know why you're here. Like, I, I like obviously... Do you like, know what? We don't know why you're in Thailand. Why? Who the hell goes on holiday for a month and just sits in a hotel and eats and moans? I mean, like, why are you there? Like, 
you need to reevaluate your life if you're just here oh my to God. see somebody's buttons get pushed. You don't. And when we're talking about reevaluating our life, eh, hey, foodie? How's that working out? What I mean, like, grow up. No, don't know hey, what Chucky. you mean. Grow up. The person who spends all her time me infantilizing herself. Earlier on in this live stream, I didn't clip it in there. Uh, she says she can't go out anywhere alone. She needs Salah, this international traveler. Always wanted to be a travel vlogger. That's <laughs> going well. Yeah, what chat would I be reading from? I don't know. I just, I hate stupid comments like that. Like, he's a Bedouin. He's stateless. He has nothing. Look, he's not a Bedouin. Um, uh, people didn't ever call him a refugee or a Badoon. That's the word you were looking for. Oh, she also says she doesn't know where Ramadan is. Uh, so, yeah, great. It's two weeks back from the last one. So, um, no one said that. And, uh, no, he's on the Syrian passport. He's a resident. He's not a citizen, though, is he? He wouldn't be in Kuwait. He wouldn't be in Kuwait. You can't be stateless in Kuwait. You need to have some kind of documentation. Like Maybe his passport's run out. But as long as you keep lying and being a weirdo, people are going to speculate. But you're too dumb to realise. But anyway, we're getting off of it because you've used the R word three times there. Not only that, you've said that you don't care, so what? Whatever. It's not whatever to the people that that upsets. <laughs> you're not going to get an apartment, that's for sure. And if I don't have a visa, right, how am I going to get an apartment? None of their theories make any fucking sense. That apartment is not in your name. That's what pisses me off. It's stupid. And the more she protests, the more it looks like a made-up situation that's as shady as shit. I know they're blaming Salah for everything. <clears throat> oh, boring day at work. Hello, Mom Silly channel. Not a whole lot. That'll make a change. Someone's just said what you've been up to. Not a whole lot. Well, when has she ever been? I enjoy listening to you. I'm a teacher homeschooling my son. Nice. Well, I hope your child's not listening to that while he's being homeschooled. I can't figure out my phone. I gotta get off of here and do it. No. This is just a little clip. Line. I don't know. I, gotta, I don't know what I gotta do. I gotta push some numbers. Yeah, right. Anyway. So, um... A lot of her bad mood is because she's been there a month and she was dumb enough to buy the SIM card and her uh, internet package at the airport. Most expensive way to do it. Um, and now she's a bit cross that she might actually have to um, sort that out herself. She's incapable of doing anything. And the, most, the, the thing that she's most incapable of doing is the change that she tells us. I'm a changed person. I found God. Really? Have you, foodie? Doesn't look like it. Anyway, that's it. I'm out. Um, so rather than you having to watch her whole damn video for the rage, I thought I'd clip it down and um, just pop it up as it is. So that's it. I'm out. Much love to you and yours. And um, yeah, if, if she's offended you today, she's a low IQ thing, creature, uh, creature, whatever, lump of matter. Don't be offended by Chantel. She's just uh, living her worst life. So yeah, wherever we are, we're, we're a step above. So that's it. I'm out of here. Take care. Bye-bye.